This video shows some highlights from ICRA, the most important conference in the large and diverse field of robotics and automation. Some roboticists focus on designing and controlling new mechanisms, such as these rod actuators, useful for robotic surgery. This robot hand is powered by actuators made of sewing threads, which mimic the design and contraction of human muscles. Mechanisms are combined together to create complex bodies, like this exoskeleton, which can stand on its own. Flying vehicles are also robots. This one is solar-powered and hand-launchable, and can be used for long-endurance search and rescue missions. This vehicle uses a new mechanical design to control thrust, roll, pitch, and yaw from only two motors. These small quad rotors are intrinsically safe and robust to collisions with the environment. Some robots look like snakes and their locomotion mimics their biological inspiration. In this system, robots are used to move cars out of tight parking spaces so that a garage can be used more efficiently. Some robots are very small. This miniature robot self-folds like an origami and is able to walk and maneuver. This tiny robot is visually guided by magnetic fields and can be used to manipulate objects. Robots use a variety of sensors for perception. In this case, a camera and a gyroscope are used for accurate image stabilization. Mobile robots need the ability of building a map of the environment to navigate in unknown areas. In this case, an elevation map is built using onboard cameras. Image processing makes it possible to distinguish previously unknown objects from the background and other objects. Camera images can be used to keep track of the pose of an object being manipulated. Planning means finding a motion that respects the bodies and the environment's constraints. For example, you want a solar-powered planetary rover to remain continuously in sunlight. Simplified dynamic models are used to plan very fast motions while being robust to the imperfections of a rough terrain. This robot uses optimization to obtain trajectories that keep it stable while performing fast dynamic motions on difficult terrain. Another challenge is planning motions for high dimensional systems, such as an arm grasping objects in a very cluttered environment. Sometimes the geometry of the environment can be used to the robot's advantage to simplify the grasping problem. A complicated task like folding a chair involves planning considering both symbolic discrete tasks and continuous motions. Modern robots are able to coordinate. These two robots are given two independent tasks and can resolve their conflicts on the fly. These robots have learned what they need to communicate so they can work together towards a common goal. New lightweight robots can safely share the workspace with humans because they're aware of where we are and how we interact with them. This robot has learned to collaborate with the user from previous demonstrations and can now recognize the user's intentions. New learning techniques enable this surgical robot to autonomously execute the tedious segments of surgical operations. In the future, everybody will be able to program robots using visual programming languages. Come to ICRA this May in Seattle to see all of this and more.